Hey y'all, I am back, I am back, I am back again with another quick one. Oh man, things are happening similar to what I'm saying. Put this in the charger right quick. Sorry about that, I got disconnected. But I'm going to play a little, little nibbit of this audio. And y'all can check it out because it's all over uh the internet and this is similar to what i have been saying and i wonder could i add a snippet of what i have said i'm I'm gonna try that but uh let's get ready to hear what mr charleston white has to say and i explain the reason why i use this picture after i get through letting y'all hear what mr charleston white has to say. Yeah, Let's go. Everybody want to know, man, what's your take on the situation, man? We wait. We wait to hear. We wait to hear what you got to say. We wait to hear what you got to say. But I wasn't there. I wasn't there, man. Uh, I told somebody today, I talked to Lil Migo. I talked to Lil Migo manager. Yeah, yeah, I talked to Lil Migo manager today. This is the part that that kind of like it brings chills to my body because it confirms what I was saying. Let's go. That's take off little brother. I said, say, do we have any kids? He said, nah, I ain't have no kids. I said, well, was he married? He said, nah. I was thinking about the children because the children are the livelihood. It's, it's like the bloodline, but let's finish this. I don't want to keep dipping in and dipping out, but I'll give my input at the end. Let's my go. Man, he was the man of the family. He had his mama. He had his sister, and he had his little brother, little Miko. So I talked to the manager. I was already kind of fucking with the Miko, nigga, uh, uh, by, by way of little Miko manager. And so when I go to Miami, I fuck with little Miko a few times. When I'm in Atlanta, I fuck with him. Uh, so, uh, motherfucker said, man, what you, what, what you gonna say? Well, nigga, what I'm gonna say about something I don't know nothing about? So just, just, just for all the people that don't know nothing about nothing, I, I want y'all to listen. Let me see, I wanna get some work on. Yeah, yeah, I want y'all to listen to this, y'all. Yeah, yeah, I want y'all to listen to this. Uh, uh, I, I tell niggas all the time, especially kids, say, listen, little homie, uh, you don't get to pick who you born to. You don't get to pick your mother and father. I beg to differ. I had to cut in on that. You do get to pick that. If you actually go back and see, you will see that you truly chose to be here. Now, let's finish. Uh, whatever has happened to you as a kid is not your fault because you, you didn't ask to be here. You didn't ask to come to Earth. Your mom yes, and daddy produced you and made you, and so you was born in these conditions. You had no say-so over that. So, yes, you did. You had more say so than you could ever imagine. You wanted to experience this. Don't ask me how I know this, but let's finish. Boom. So when it's time to die, nigga, you ain't, if you ain't got no say so on how you get here with life, you ain't got no say so on how you leave her, right? So you don't get to pick how you born and you don't get to choose how you die. Mm-hmm. Uh, what, what matters is the dash. So your birth date and your death date, that's already set. The dash in the middle, you write that, right? So, uh, nigga, when it's your time, it's your time. Uh, so I had to remind myself, as I'm sitting back, list everybody waiting on me to say something, I had to remind myself, nigga, uh, death ain't bad. He's waiting on him like he got all the answers. Who, 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 he got who, all the answers who, wait. who done told us that death is a bad thing? Yeah, who told us that? So I want y'all to listen to this. Listen carefully. Uh, and maybe this will change your mind about what happened to Quavo. <laughs> My mind stayed the same because I'm saying all what he's saying. Second hand, mishand, uh, wrong information. So I want y'all to listen to this. Hold on. So what? 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 What they were shooting? Thousands? Everybody in the world of a thousand people, like twenty motherfuckers. I ain't worried about no motherfucking that beat me. They ain't. I ain't gonna beat them. Well, let me rob it. It's over. They can win. Well, you and I shoot. You and I shooting hard. Now, actually, he did. He had the word of one of the, the rabble I did. 
Y'all hear that? He turned that glass up five to six times. Wasn't nothing in the glass to drink. And he still was gloping at that. It's something that's... Oh, I saw a movie like that. Let me finish this. I'm going to tell y'all the movie I saw. He was already, yeah, he's right. Let's finish. Mm. Boy, you done fried, boy, you done, boy, you done arrested my spirit with this one. Hey, man, 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 now, I want y'all to hear what that man and his wife said. That man was in a whole nother dimension. He didn't talk to nobody. He wasn't shooting dice. He had an empty cup that he kept drinking out of and didn't have nothing in it. And he stood up and he just stood up and got hit. Man, when it's your time, it's your time. It ain't nobody fault. Can't no. Now I'm done with that part. Now, here come the beautiful part where I interject my conversation in it. Now, let me go to my videos, because I know which video it should be. Okay, let me see. Oh, man. Oh, take off transition. I think that's it. Let me see how far. I'm going to pause it for a while. Hold up. Come through. Come through. Now I'm using the spiritual, because now somebody don't got knocked into the spiritual realm. I think that's it. Rise infinitely high. Take off because you have truly taken off to another realm. Now, I'm willing to bet anyone who was around him that day, they're going to say, he was acting funny. He was saying weird things as if he knew he was going to leave us. I'm willing to bet. Now, it's now I'm done with my part. Now, had I would have bet. I would have won. I would have won all the money. <laughs> Listen, had I would have bet, the proof is in the video. I took that video the same day it happened, uh, November the 1st. Mr. Charleston White just put this video out yesterday, okay? I put, I put my input of what I thought. That's basically what I'm trying to say because... I'm gonna be honest. It ain't about being wrong or right. It's about tapping in with to, it's to for me and to me. It's about tapping in with your spirituality, and then once you tap in with your spirituality, how the hell can I go wrong? It's impossible, cause the spiritual reality exists before the physical reality. So it's it's no way you could go wrong when you are in tune. When man, when I heard that, when I heard that. You know how my heart just said, cha-cha-cha, cha-cha-cha. It, was, it wasn't about being right. Let me make this clear. It's, it's, it, it was the frequency because that man could have said anything else. 
And I said, my jaw dropped because I was on Night and Day channel. Y'all haven't went and checked out their channel. Go give them a check. I tell them, Velvet My Heart sent you. Ah, uh, yeah. And they got some great CBD products. And they got a lot of good stuff, man. Check them out on Night and Day CBD. And I'm not getting sponsored for this. This is free. And check them out on Night and Day, I think, uh, shopping, if I'm not mistaken. But, yeah, man. Oh, they got them shower curtains on fleek. I'm finna get mine. The show lives. I'm just waiting the right time. Cause I don't wanna it's, it's I want I know how I wanna do my house. I can't do it how I wanna do it right right now. But it's coming. Cause the see the action of the vision takes place first, right? And then you you then you use your second power. Ooh, that's the willpower to make everything manifest. Okay? Oh, I'm going to post that second part of that video up because I did two parts of it. Well, technically, it's one part. I broke it down into two parts. But I'm going to let this stay just as it is. I ain't breaking nothing down from this video. I said to myself, how in the hell would I know what I said? I said to myself, I could bet you if you get around any of his friends, They'll tell you that that man was acting weird that day. And he truly was. Is there anything else that I would like to say? Don't don't just, you know, oh, man, there's just so much I could say. But I, well, all I need to say, I'm going to go through myself and say this. Oh, they got bananas. I'm going to get me a banana. Oh, big juicy bananas. Oh, my God. And why they let these go bad? I could have made banana bread. Homemade. But anyhow, I ain't talking about bananas. Fall back, Missy. No, we got oranges, tangerines. We got, oh, we got, we got the perfect, perfect fruits for the LSD. Why you had to be needy? Stop following everywhere I go. But yes, that's what happened. And, you know, you can't. And somebody talking about the wages of sin and stuff. Uh, like you. Technically, you are immortal. I want to. I want to get that clear. But your avatar isn't. Let's make that clear, okay? Your avatar will leave you one day, and seek for another place, okay? And is there any? Get out of this kitchen, girl. You know goddamn well you don't come in here. Period. Is there anything else? Oh, they got some. Okay, all right then. Is there anything else that I would like to say before I leave? Good love. I mean, to my good love. Good vibrations, man. Stay out, stay in your, stand in your square, no matter what. That's why I made that video, and I was so passionate about what I said because I truly believe that our thoughts are creating our reality, man. And I honestly believe in my heart and in my mind, body, and soul and spirit. And if we change the way we treat each other, even the way we think about each other, we could change the way the world is. I'm out. Perks. Oh, man. Oh, before I leave. If I say I'm out one more game, but surely I'm going to be out after this. Let me break this down to y'all. The reason why I have this photo up here, if y'all look carefully, y'all will see that. Uh, y'all will see take off with the maroon jacket, with the black scully. And y'all will see... Quavo in the middle, and y'all will see Offset at the end. I don't know if y'all noticed, this is a rap snack uh, cover. Takeoff doesn't look at his watch. He's looking like he's looking in another dimension. Quavo is looking at his watch, and, off, uh, and Offset is, is with his watch up in the air, so that Shows me right there symbolically he knew his time was up. I'm out. Peace.